Hey guys, Elpaka77 here, and I did tell you guys that I bring you a Inform Palashi review, so here it is. This is the video that I promised. So we'll jump straight into the review, and Inform Alberto Palashi is an Italian right winger that plays in Serie A for Chievo Verona on loan from AC Milan, I think it is. His normal card is a striker, and to be honest, I think he should have been a striker, as I think he ended up playing centre forward in the match, and not actually right winger, but oh well. He has three star skill moves, four star weaker foot, and on the Xbox, he's been going for about 65k. And on the PS3, according to Footwiz, about 55k. If you're interested in the team I was using him in, I made this sort of 4 3 2 1 Italian silver team. It wasn't too great, if I'm honest. I played him right forward, but I kind of switched him around, tried him left forward, tried him at striker. Then I also tried him in my 4 2 3 1 Serie A silver team, the usual team that I use, and tried subbing him on as a striker, and he did play a bit better there. Cast, that's why he's got 79 pace, 77 dribbling, 71 shooting and 78 heading. We can move on to his in-game stats now and he is 6 foot, he is right footed, has medium work rates and the 4 star weak foot, 3 star skill moves. If you're interested in his traits, he has try speed defensive line and dives into tackles. His physical attributes, they're quite nice, 83 acceleration, 84 agility, 80 balance, 83 jumping, 84 reactions and 79 sprint speed, 75 strength. In his mental attributes, he has 66 aggression and 83 attacking position, which is really, really nice. And lastly, there's his skill attributes with 82 ball control, 75 dribbling, 89 finishing, 78 heading accuracy, 80 penalties, 72 short pass, 77 shot power and 87 volleys. So the gameplay should be on your screens now and if I'm honest, I was really disappointed in him. He didn't score many goals at all and he just didn't feel like a winger. I know his normal card was a striker and they did change him to a winger and that really didn't help. That kind of ruined this card to be honest as I would have preferred him as a striker. And as I said I did do think he did play at, did actually play centre forward and not a winger. But I don't really know. But anyway they did kind of ruin his card, made him into a winger. He isn't a winger. He didn't have the agility, he didn't have the balance on, the, as, on a winger that I usually like. And I, was, I thought that he'd be something like Toscano. I thought he'd be sort of slow. 79 sprint speed, a bit like Toscano, the underrated silver of the week that I showed you. He's slower than the usual winger, but I thought he'd make up for it with his shooting and his strength. And to be honest, he got muscled off the ball so much. There's so many times he just fell over. Seriously, there's, I haven't used another player that's fallen over as much. And some of the defenders weren't even strong defenders. They were just the fast ones that aren't particularly strong. They just mus muscled him off the ball and he fell over so much. His shooting as well, shooting was very, very disappointing. His long shots were absolutely awful. They just went over every single time, just high and wide everywhere. His finishing was was decent though, 89 finishing. When he got through on goal, you could finesse it with him, but the problem was actually trying to get through on goal. His 83 attacking positioning, I didn't really notice that. He was never really in the right position. And I just couldn't find the right position for him. He did play slightly better when I subbed him on as a striker in my Serie A silver squad in the 4-2-3-1. But as I said, just really, really disappointing player. And for the sort of 70k, 65, 70k you're going to pay for him, there are much better options and I'd rather try other players. So overall, do I think he's worth it? Well, this may be a bit short to my other reviews because I do not have enough gameplay with him. And that kind of shows the thing. If I don't have enough gameplay with someone, it usually tells you guys that he's not particularly good. As the players I have lots of gameplay for, I've enjoyed using them and they're pretty good. But he was awful. I didn't really like him at all. He just felt really sluggish and his shooting was not as good as I thought it would be. So thanks for watching guys and I hope you enjoyed this silver player review of Inform Alberto Pelosi. I'll try and get an Inform Boston review up sometime soon as well as I think I'm going to try and do something a little different and try and review like Kyate and Donk as they're really expensive defenders and you guys probably want to know whether they're worth it. So I think that'll be a bit of a challenge, try and review some defenders, maybe like Mariapa and Basong as well, as they might be quite fun to do. As always, if you enjoyed the video, please feel free to give it a like as that helps to get the video out there. And thanks for watching guys, cheers.